Look, very, very few women will ever go up to you and tell you they like you and they want you to go on a date. There are, they exist. There's bold women out there, but you're probably never gonna run into them. They're like unicorns, meaning that you're gonna have to be able to interpret her body language to know if that chick wants to date you and good thing you got your older brother. Let's hop into this. Number one, their body language is open to you. You need to understand one thing. By default, women are always walking around closed off. They'll, they'll have their books, they'll have their purse. They'll always be, look tight and closed off because they always feel threatened, right? Men are big scary dudes that they, they can cause harm, therefore they're always scared of men. Meaning that for whatever reason, she decides to open up to you, right? Now her body language is open. Now her body and her hips are pointing towards you. This is a very good sign that she's starting to trust you and more importantly, she kind of likes you, bro. Number two, she gets jealous. This one's a powerful one and it's subtle too. See, once you start getting to know somebody, you're starting to build this emotional connection. The more you talk to her, if you notice that she gets a little annoyed, Maybe her face changes when you talk about other women or talk about your past or talk about exes or you see her change the subject immediately. Obviously, she's not trying to look psycho in front of you, but these are signs of jealousy. These are signs that she is bothered that you're talking about other women when it's clear as day that she wants to date you. Number three, she makes eye contact with you or you catch her gazing on you, especially if you catch her doing that multiple times. Look, don't be shocked or alarmed. You don't look funny. Instead, she's probably looking at something worthwhile. She's looking at something that she's hoping is going to approach her. Again, don't get shocked or alarmed. This is that TMF effect. See, you've probably been watching enough videos where you know how to step out looking like the price. You know if you want to look more attractive, you'll throw on that pair of glasses. You'll put on your favorite clothes and do that on a daily basis. So those stairs, they should start to become a norm for you, bro. This is why I've always told you, if you want to start leveling up, one of the easiest accessories to do so, pair of glasses, bro. There is no accessory in a man's tool chest that will make you look that good. See, glasses will structure your face. Glasses will hide imperfections. Glasses will protect your eyes and skin from the sun's rays. And more importantly, glasses make you look stylish. Yeah. Come on, come on. How can she not want to date you? when you look this good. Bro, I had to cut the video. I had to cut the video. We just got our blue light blocking designs in. So like I said, I don't know if you remember from my previous video, May 28th, our new collection for Jade Black is dropping. We've been working for months to get this inventory in because it's taking, bro, right now our lead times is six, seven months just to get inventory in. And we were worried we weren't gonna get these in time. Bro, look at these new blue light designs. How can this girl, how, how could she not be impressed? How could she not want to date you? Bro, May 28th, we're dropping a new collection. This has taken well over six months to get into our warehouse just because of all the shortages, which means this is like gold, right? This is like gold to get your hands on, meaning May 28th, you should put a reminder because when this collection drops, you should be first in line. I'm telling you right now, if you don't get your hands on one of these, chances are you probably won't at least for the next few months. And it's summer. How can it go, you be going to summer and you not update your frame collection? You can pick up a blue light and a pair of sunglasses, still only around a hundred bucks and we do free shipping and free returns. Bro, back to the video. Number four, their schedule is flexible for you. This one's crucial. See, everybody has their own life. Everybody has things going on in their life. But if she happens to always adjust her life for you, yo, she wants to date you. You tell her, yo, let's go study this day. And she says, yes. Yeah. You tell her, yo, let's go get some coffee. Yo, let's go eat lunch together. Yo, let's go do this. And every single time it's yes and never a reschedule. I promise you, she's rescheduling other things to make sure she makes that date. Number five, they want you to meet her friends. This is pretty intense. This is getting deep and close. You're already starting to be friends. You guys are talking all the time and she invites you to a party with her friends or to go have dinner or mimosas or brunch with their friends. And see, th this is one step before meeting the parents. This is almost as important as meeting the family, but a little bit less. It should let you know this girl wants to date you. Ultimately rolls on to number six. She makes you a genuine compliment. This one's crucial. See, again, women by default, they're not out here giving compliments to men. They're usually more shy and introverted than men, meaning they're not just gonna throw compliments at you unless 
they want to date you unless they want you for themselves. So if she's telling you, yo, nice haircut, yo, nice shoes, yo, you always smell good, you're such a hard worker, oh, you're so, she's always giving you a compliment about something that you guys have experienced, especially the more genuine and unique that compliment is, bro, the more chances this girl wants to date you. And that's basically it for this week's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, boys, don't forget to check out our brand, Jade Black. If you, if you guys want glasses, that I promise you, bro, they'll make you look like a problem. Yo, you got to pick up a pair down below. That's it for your boy. See you next time.